Hello students, my name is Sumit Mehta. So today in this lecture, we will discuss about defects of vision and their correction. So we will discuss about in this lecture the three main defects of vision uh, or three common reflective defects of vision. First is myopia or it is called as nearsightedness nearsightedness second is hypermetropia or it is called as farsightedness third is respiopia Okay, so we will discuss each defect in detail in this lecture. So student, first we are discussing about myopia. So in this defect, it is also known as nearsightedness as I have told you. A person with myopia can see nearby objects clearly. A person can see nearby objects clearly but cannot see but cannot see distant objects distinctively distant objects distinctly Okay, so a person with this defect has the four point near than infinity. So let me draw this. Let's say this is our I. Okay, students. So for a person, if the object is very far, so what he will see that the light rays are coming parallel from a far objects okay and here is the eye lens so when light these light rays strike so at the retina, in a myopic eye, the image of a distant object is formed in front of the retina and not at the retina itself. So, if this is a defect because image is forming here somewhere and it should be formed here, uh, like it is distant object I is seen. Okay, so image image formed in front of retina but not at retina ok students so this image should be formed at retina so to correct this effect defect the uh, the main reason for this defect was excessive curvature of the eye lens, elongation of the eye, eyeball. Okay, and this defect can be used, can be corrected by using a concave lens. So I am showing here how this defect can be. So this again I am drawing a eye. So when light rays enter spiral, okay. So a concave lens is used before entering the so and this lens now the image is formed at retina itself. So this is a concave lens. Okay, students. 
so how this defect is removed by using a concave lens of proper focal length of suitable power will bring the image back on the retina thus the defect is correct okay students now i hope that you understand the defect called as myopia so in the next lecture we will discuss about hypermetropia and resbiopia students so stay tuned for the next lecture in which we will discuss about hypermetropia thank you happy learning